I was talking with Blakely, the soccer player that I keep on referencing, and I said in basketball, you know, the first two questions you're getting asked is, how many points did you score and did you win? And I go, can you relate to that at all? And she started smiling, I can't make this up. She literally takes her phone out of her pocket and shows me a text from her youth coach. Here's what the text was. Or the first two questions the coach asks her. She says, 3-0, we play great. <laughs> so when a coach says, what happened, what signal does that send to her? Something's wrong. And they, they just won 3-0 and she played great, yet something's wrong. So I had her articulate the way she was feeling and she wrote it down and here's what she said. So it is really hard for me to not focus on results when in all honesty, that is all everyone cares about. I definitely believe that it shouldn't be about the results and I cannot let that control me. However, it still just bothers me that even if I personally focus on myself and not the results, the rest of the world, media, fans, success, still gives everything to the one with the results. That is the hardest thing for me. Raise your hand if you can relate to that a little bit, okay? And when I ask that question to athletes, all the hands shoot up. So what I did is I gave her a list of these character skills. And I'm gonna ask you the same questions that I asked her. I asked her to pick three performance and three moral skills just to prove this point. She picked positive, focused, resilient for the performance side, and on the moral side, she picked unselfish, appreciative, and loyal. I'm gonna ask you the same question I asked her, and I'd like to see a show of hands. How many of you guys think that if we work really, really hard at these skills, that they can actually be developed? Can I see a show of hands? Anybody that doesn't think that? Okay, so I asked her that question. Can you actually develop these skills? And she said what? Yes, it is in my control to develop these things. Then I asked her, well, do you think that if you became more positive, focused, and resilient, that it would actually make you a better player? Okay, well, do you think that if you became more unselfish, loyal, and appreciative, that it would actually make you a better teammate? Do you see how if you grew these skills, it would actually make you a better player and a better teammate, which would lead to better results? That makes complete sense. And that is the way that we link character development towards developing and getting better results.